just a very short video this morning. I have one of these guys, the new swing stop for the Panto router, and I've been giving it a try. Come on over here, I'll show you how it works. For tenons that are up to one and a half inches long, you put this guy in the one, two, three, fourth slot. For tenons up to two and three quarters long, you put it in the one, two, the third slot. My tenons this morning are about one inch long, so I'm going for this fourth slot. So I'm not gonna go over the adjustments don't pertain uh, specifically to the swing uh, stop. I'm, I've already adjusted for the thickness here, and I've adjusted for the center of the stock here with the fence here. Now, the first thing to do is run this guy up and notice I'm holding it tight between here and here. That's very important. If you don't get it tight and you're off like this, this is going to change the distance. This is how you want to lock this guy in. Okay, We're locked in, pushed it up to there where we want it. Lock, clamp brother in place, and we can swing this away. Now we need to adjust for the depth of cut. Okay, so I'm going to take the bit, touch off on the end of the stock, lock that position in with this stop back here, and I can drop the router now. And all right, one inch spacer. There, our one inch depth is set. Can put the um, dust shroud back together and um, turn this guy on and cut a tenon. So the swing stop works as advertised. Perfect uh, registration every time, easy to set up.